Good afternoon, members and fans. Hope you're well. I just want to give you a little update on the uh, 18th team proposal and progress. Uh, as you know, Billy and myself are over here in Perth at the moment. And I just want to give some clarity because obviously the media starts to run with some ideas and uh, everyone starts having their opinion. I want to be very, very clear that there's several not negotiables for the Bears that we're going to any um, conversations who we'll have with any party, not just the Perth people. And that is the colour, the history, the logo, etc. will always be owned by our football club. Uh, we're never giving that up for anything. And to be honest, yeah, a big consideration for us and where we decide to um, put our bid in is going to be around the long-term sustainability and viability of this venture. Because the last thing we want is in two years' time for the Bears to be uh, on the rocks. And so we're going to make sure we do our due diligence and work around ensuring that the Bears' success is uh, long-lasting. Yes, we want to be back in the NRL, but more importantly, we want our mighty red and black to be reigning supreme forever. So... Uh, Perth is, is definitely an option for us, and I know there's a lot of people, uh, big fans of that, and there's some people who don't like it. We're never going to please anyone, uh, but the narrative has changed in the last six months. Before, everyone was saying, you know, hope, uh, which I didn't like at all, but now it's the Bears are the only team that people are speaking about. It's just the location which is undecided. Uh, we've had contact from Christchurch, obviously Perth, who we're talking to the guys over here, uh, and everyone's very, very respectful of the brand and our, our long history and heritage that we have, which is awesome as they should be, and I know they want to partner with us for the fact that they feel that there's so many steps uh, in an NRL um, resubmission that uh, we already have in rich heritage, history, fans, uh, loyal fans. Peter Volandis talks about tribalism. Uh, we've got that to the get-go, and it's important for us to make sure we choose the right area. So please understand that it is not only Perth. Uh, we are still pursuing our own uh, regional opportunities in New South Wales, and there's others as well. It's just we're, we're making sure we look into everything thoroughly. Um, like I've said several times, and I'll say it again, uh, we have some great financial backers, and we've had another one join us recently, which you'll hear about more soon. Um, and there's more people continuing to show their support for the Bears, and I anticipate that's only going to get better. So again, I'm telling you so you hear it from me. Unfortunately, the one the article this morning in um, WA, I was misquoted several times, but nothing was bad. Uh, and I don't believe any media is too bad for the Bears. Like I said, there's no one else being spoken about as a team. Um, the NRL, who I spoke to again last week, um, still have not put out any dates where this is um, taking place, but we're keeping them updated with our progress, and we are all steam ahead. So uh, my uh, goal of today was just to give you clarity that we are pursuing um, an 18th team position, and more importantly, we're just looking at what is the best place. And if we do need a partner, if we are going to go somewhere where a partner is required, uh, who will that be and who's best for the long-term sustainability and viability of the Bears? Thanks very much and enjoy the origin.